let's take a look at how you'll access, fill out, and share your digital Cornell notes or C notes at iUniversity Prep. Begin by signing into Google from your web browser. Once you have, you'll be able to access the C note template. When you need to make a new C note, navigate your browser to tinyurl.com backslash IUPREP C notes. You'll see a blank and somewhat colorful Cornell note open up in a Google Doc. You might also notice that you can't edit or add to this document. To use this template, click File, then make a copy. You'll see an option to name your C note, and I suggest you use something descriptive, including the subject and the date. A new tab will open with what looks like the exact same Google Doc, but it isn't. It is a copy you just made, and you'll notice that it now it is fully editable. Where is that copy? It's automatically been saved on the top level of your Google Drive. Don't remember how to access the drive? Don't worry. At the beginning of the year, you set up your Google Drive folders for each subject and then link them to your Google site. Our goal is to make sure any C note you make will automatically show up on the Google site and you can access and change them from that single location. When you're done, what you will need to do is tell the software to move the C note into the right folder. Click File, then Move to Folder. You'll see the folders in your Google Drive appear. Save the C note to the appropriate one and exit your browser. Bingo! You've just saved an individualized Cornell note. Open up your site and navigate to that subject's page and you'll notice that your new little Cornell note is waiting there for you. It can be accessed, read, or altered by you or your teachers right from here. I hope this little tutorial helped you get a handle on digital Cornell notes at iUniversity Prep.